In this video, I will discuss how to create object with the use of accounts and assets library in Life Day and provide an overview of this concept. Let's explore how to create object with the use of accounts and assets library in this video. First, we must know what is library object, account and assets libraries. What is what is library object? Library object is a low code way to build and develop application without writing code or developing modules. Object defines the information of an application and collects and manages information. In object, we can add custom data fields. Also, we can define complex relationships, design custom layouts, and define object scope. Lively accounts We can use accounts as user account creation and administration. Adding default addresses in accounts, creation, modification, deletion of user accounts, user profile customization, and attribute management. Assets library Assets library is a feature that allows users to manage and organize various types of assets within their portal. Assets can be included like documents, image, video, web contents, and more. Assets library provides an centralized repository where these assets can be stored, categorized and easily accessed by user. Let's move to our browser. We have our server GA100 is open, library GA100 is open. Now login with administration portal. Open application menu and go to control panel. Now let's move to the objects. We can see that these are system objects. Add a custom object here with the name return order. Save it. Go to accounts. Go to relationships, click on plus icon, add new relationship with the name, return account and type as one to many, many records of our custom object that is return order, click on save. Go to postal address, go to relationships, add a new relationship here with the name type as one to many, many type of custom object and parameter as return account. Click on save. Go to commerce order, go to relationships, add a new relationship with the name return. Type as one to many, many records of or custom object. Then click on save. Let's move to our custom object, go to fields, you can see all the relationship fields are here, add a custom field here with the name, reason for return, type is rich text, click on mandatory click on save go to details and the title field as author scope as site and panel link as site administration people section click on publish
let's move to our web page go to site administration go to people section you can see our custom object is here that is return order add a new return request I have added some accounts and addresses orders from or account section and orders from a commerce site and then click on return account I have an account of with the name Panshu return address with the Panshu Khandelwal and return order with the I want to return this order with the ID three four five eight seven and the reason for it uh, don't need it click on save the our, our return request is added here let's publish it on our web page click on editing mode search assets publisher click on configurations click on dynamic scope as or custom object that is written of order we click on save publish this web page and now we can see our written request is here with the help of assets publisher thank you for watching this video